sworn in and ready to take office this morning. Orange County held its oath of office ceremony, swearing in two commissioners for their second terms and one for her very first. The commissioners taking oath a day after the county released some grim tourism numbers for this year. News 6's Ezzy Castro was there to learn more about how county leadership plans to tackle the issues ahead. Orange County is now seeing more tourist tax money than it did a couple of months ago. And we asked the mayor about that. He says that 2021 is looking up. And meanwhile, he gained a new commissioner. Orange County officially swearing in three commissioners during an oath of office ceremony this morning. New member to the board this year, Commissioner Nicole Wilson for District 1. And District 3 Commissioner Myra Uribe and District 5 Commissioner Emily Bonilla were sworn in for their second terms. Each one making a promise to help better the Orange County community. We are problem solvers who will work tirelessly for a better tomorrow. And just yesterday, the county announced it collected more than $7.7 .7 million dollars in tourist tax money back in October, making the sixth straight month of increases. But revenue was down 69% compared to October of last year. For the last six months since April, each month our tourist development tax receipts have gone up each month. So I believe that in November we're going to see a bump again in our tourist development tax receipts. But the mayor added there is still a lot more work to do to bounce back financially from the pandemic, such as creating new jobs and investing in community business. So the fact that in 2021 we have rebooked new conventions that will come here that will help to stimulate our local economy, and I believe that 2021 is looking up. In Orange County, Ezzy Castro getting results, News 6.